Hey. Um, back at it again. <laughs> Continuing. My internet went down. Dan, Dan, Dan. Uh, so yeah. I think Chloe. I'm getting uh, lost in all this shit. Uh, Chloe, what's her name? Rachel is dead. This is my personal opinion because everybody typing there that she's in a dark room. Dark room is actually like, you know, something happened. Oh no, that poor little bird has been trapped in here. Where's this little shit? Maybe she's gonna, gonna get into the window. Here we go. Where is she? Fly, be free. There you go. Who else flying here? Jeez. So, uh... Yeah, checking some shit in the garage. Okay. Garage. Hey there, David. You won this battle, Max. You broke up my family. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you. Ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe too late isn't it you just better be damn careful with her don't you wander off into the dark what the fuck he said he said in the dark they all know about the dark room but not me god damn it little shits here I am Max Warren Yo, yo, Max, your friend Chloe texted me that I'm out loop the sound. Wait, what? Chloe actually texted you? I'm sure she didn't have number. At least to still get a go ape with you unless you want to chill with Chloe or we could go all go. One plan, one pain is the... God damn it. One pain in the ass is enough. Cool, I have to jet talk to you later. Whatever. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. Something going on with the internet all over the world, damn it. I want turning off. Everybody else is turning it off. What am I doing? Searching for clues? Lockers. Foods. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? <clears throat> David must be working for the Prescotts, too. Well, I guess they all want to kill them. Should I have signed the petition? Blackwell sure isn't safe and private anymore. Oh, meow, Miss Grant. Twist that knife. Special coming. <laughs> at least he has one weird fan. Anonymous. Just one selection. I think it's bullshit what happened to you and this school has too many leaptired metrosexuals who don't appreciate you or the military. I felt safe in my dorm when you were in charge and I th thought about you pr protecting me. I hope you will come back to Black Hole and make sure we are all safe at night. I'm scared of this school. Who's that? Who been typing? Wish I had surveillance footage of that conversation. I apologize for my uh, outburst yesterday in my in, in your office. I was upset about losing my position in Blackwell without a complete investigation. Okay. There's more to David Madsen than meets the eye. He should finish this letter to Joyce. Oh my lord, 
Joyce, you know I'm not good at explaining myself and not writing either, seems like. Or why I had the way to... Okay. Uh, or why I act li the way I do sometimes. I only know that nobody has ever understood me the way you do. I would never do anything to hurt you or Chloe. Uh, yeah, right. <laughs> Taking care of my family is my number one mission. It's... This person keep talking about something that he's in the military, goddammit. Yes, I overstepped bounds with the surveillance and suspicions and I am truly sorry and ashamed, but there are dark things happening in Arcadia Bay I have never told you. He knows m more than everybody else here. Little shit. You are my wife and partner and I know you should have no secrets. We should have no secrets. I intend to tell you everything, but I wanted more proof. More, more proof. <laughs> Instead, a student almost committed suicide on my watch. He kicked me out of my favorite, favorite hub, and my stepdaughter hates me. Please let me. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William again. I wish Chloe could too. What the hell did David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? Mr. Madsen, thank you for your help with Nathan. It's appreciated. Hmm. Either Chloe stole another gun or David is out there armed. Uh oh, he gonna go and kill Kate, isn't he? She knows too much. I wonder if David is going to the party. <gasps> You're going to the party? You're going to kill everybody? Is he a murderer? What am I doing here? What's the mission? It's a... Joyce must be so upset. Are you helping anybody, Max? Doubt it. Uh... Wait, so what should I do? I don't understand. There's no way I can go to Chloe without going to David's locker. Ah. I see. Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David, what you hiding? Uh... Yeah, for right. once, I don't have time to search for the code. Oh, I need to find a way to break this padlock. Oh, crowbar. Okay, I can use that crowbar to pry open the locker. Oh, jeez. David is packing up wedding stuff, too. So whatever, girl. Sorry, David, but I bet you would do the same thing as me. Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. What the actual hell? Score. Back to Chloe now. Can I rewind so I just like, so I didn't break the thing? Yeah! <laughs> No one will ever know. Yas. God damn it. This is so my fault that Joyce kicked David out. Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. 
But I absolutely have to go see Kate in the hospital right now. I want to find out how she's doing. Yas. I'm such a ninja. <laughs> this is definitely Kate's floor. The hospitals always freak me out. I, I hear you. But imagine how Kate feels. I'm so glad I, I get to see her again. I hope it's not too weird for her. No, she'll be stoked to see you. Who wouldn't be? This be it. I'm a little nervous. Oh my Just god. Go in there and be your friend. Is she dead? Because I'll everything... be out here so you can chill by yourself. Everybody asking. I was a total dick for blowing a fuse when you answered Kate's call the other day. Good thing you ignored me. I had no idea what shit she was going through. And you saved her. Like me. I'm sorry. Yeah, you best be. Jeez. Thanks, Chloe. But don't be sorry. We're all on the same team. Team Max. Let Kate know we're gonna string Nathan up by his balls then. Oh yes. <laughs> all these conversations about Kate, so happy and shit. It seems like she's dead, isn't she? Open up, goddammit. She did. Oh. Oh. I mean, it's good. I mean, but I thought. <laughs> oh, well. Max! Oh, Kate. I thought I'd never see you again. I feel so ridiculous. I'm so sorry. Kate, listen to me. You have nothing to be sorry about. Other people do. You do not know how happy I am to see you. You look awesome. Is it a stupid question if I ask how you're doing? Now that you're here, I'm doing even better. I'm so grateful to you for coming up to the roof to talk me down. Max, I felt so lost and alone. When I saw how much you cared, how hard you were trying, you made me realize I wasn't alone. Thank you. Kate. There are so many people who love you and want to help you. I know. You should see all the letters and postcards. I gave most of the flowers to other patients here because they need them more than me. I'm keeping the balloons, though. <laughs> One of the nurses gave me some pen and paper so I could do some drawings. I love your illustrations. They got kind of dark there for a while. But I have an idea for a new children's book about bullying. I was thinking of having some photographs in there, too. I hope that's a subtle hint that you'll let me take the photographs for the book. Was that subtle? You better take the pictures, Max. I'm going to be here for another day until my family comes out to visit. How are they treating you? Like they need to protect me forever. They're so upset, and I know they feel guilty even though they didn't do anything. I was surprised how many students from Blackwell wrote me. Daniel, Mr. Jefferson, even Victoria wrote me a very sweet note, and I believe she was being real. Me too. I'm glad you believe again, Kate. I'm working on it, Max. I just pray I can get this drawing right. Something never changes, and it's her old school haircut. Stop lagging, game. Oh. <laughs> I love Kate's happy rainbow flock. Good to see that Kate is still working on her book report. I don't think get well is quite apropos. I think it is. If this gets Kate through the night, so be it. Those are nice flowers. And from Taylor? Wow, props to her. Principal Wells knows how to step it up when he wants to. I just want to express my deepest wish for a speedy recovery and the Black Hole Academy is uni united in prayers for your return. The students and faculty have organized a really rally in your honor, and I've never seen such out 
Okay, we got it. So pouring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is so sweet. Even Victoria signed. But not Nathan. Fuck Nathan. We go and kill him. Victoria Chase might be queen bitch, but she's not evil. Kate, I know you hate me and you should. But I... I... Okay. But I only want to see your smile again. Please let me know if you need anything, Victoria. Damn, son. Thank you, sisters. You really saved Kate. Yeah, did they? I think everybody been bu bu bullying her, even her sisters, even her mom, even auntie. But not Kate, the dad. Kate, it is so good to hang out with you again. Max, I owe you so much. And I can tell you want to talk to me about something. I saw Victoria's letter. How does that make you feel? Max, I know Victoria can be... Uh... Not nice. But I do believe in forgiveness and redemption. I might be naive, but... I feel her struggle. Me too. I could have taken a picture of her covered in paint, but I didn't, and... We had a genuine moment. We all have our moments. Why do you think she acts so mean? She's a bitch. <laughs> she's insecure. I don't think that she's insecure. She's rich. She's famous. She's everything, but... I mean, why she should be insecure? She's not really ugly, isn't she? She's just a bitch. She's a bitch. I'm sorry, but she's wealthy, pretty, and yes, talented. So there's no reason for her to treat people like shit. Well, there must be. If Victoria could write me such a sincere letter. If anybody could make Victoria see the light, it would be Kate Marsh. No, I think it will take more than that, Max. I want you to know I'm this close to getting all the info I need about Nathan. Nathan Prescott has to pay for what he did. And we have to stop him from hurting anybody else. Well, I did get his ass suspended, so that might be a start. You did? Oh, right on, Max. I love how fearless you are. So what is going on with him now? Uh, I don't know. I assume he'll show up at the Vortex Club party tonight like nothing happened. And nobody can do anything to him after what he did. We're going to stop him. I just have to find Nathan's room number, get inside, and get the clues I need. Max, please let me help. I can get the number, and I'll text it to you, okay? Of course, Kate. I can't do this without you. Now it's time for Nathan to watch out for us. Yas. Dying, girl. I always want to talk to you. We missed our tea session this week. <laughs> that was so not cool. We need to plan, like, a tea shop tour of Portland. Oh, yes. And you could bring Warren along, too. Eh. Eh. Why? <laughs> I mean, why? Why? I just don't understand the problem here. Uh, okay, I mean... No, I mean... Yeah, I guess. What do you think of uh, Warren? Oh, smart and silly. He's got such a good heart. Smart and silly. And he's a cutie pie. <laughs> you know he likes you. Cutie pie. And I'm he's going to the thing. drive in with him, so... <laughs> we'll see. With everything that's going on, it... A date seems weird. No, you deserve that. Kate Marsh, matchmaker. <laughs> I'm glad somebody is looking out for my love life. Even angels need angels, Max. I have to get back to our uh, mission. You don't know how much it means to see you again. I do. That's why I love you, Max. Thanks for taking care of my bunny. Tell Alice I'll see her soon. I hope she's not dead, damn it. I fed her carrot. I gave her one damn carrot. 
Well, how is she? She's still Kate Marsh. Thank God. I'm glad we came to see her. Thanks for coming with me. Now let's go pay a visit to Nathan Prescott. That little prick is not going to be glad when he sees us. Yas. Damn. Wait, what? Where are we going? Oh. Okay. I thought to his house. Or Vortex Club. Party. Whatever. Everybody here, isn't it? Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend, Chloe. Yo. Hey, yo. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for this school. It's a long story. In actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird, just... Being on campus, like, everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much going on in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. I feel like a total loser, but... It's been a hard week to focus. No pun intended. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. <laughs> Nobody should have to see me dance. Plus, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I have some pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Oh, no. Hot for teacher. Gross! You are out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut oh, up. Geez. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. <laughs> Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. Jesus Christ. Disgusting. Let's see if I can find out where Nathan is. Oh my god. It's a triple A game project. It needs lots of resources to run it. Ride, Justin, bitches. it's been so, so long since I've seen you. Oh my god. That's so ironic that Warren asked Max to the drive in. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh, she knows. Hey, Brooke, how are you? I'm here as usual. By the way, thanks for helping Kate down. Are you okay? Yeah, are you? Bitch? <laughs> Have something against me and Warren? Huh? I, I can't get my limited brain around that eclipse and the beached whales. I was hoping the science department had some ideas. Warren and I are supposed to compare notes and theories this weekend. That makes sense. Two big brains are better than one. Or mine. We'd get the Nobel Prize if we could explain this phenomenon, but even Miss Grant has no clue. Then you guys are stupid. I need to find Nathan. Have you seen him around? Ask Warren. I mean, you're going to the movies with him and everything. Come on, Brooke. Don't be that way. Nathan was suspended, but he should still be on campus. Warren's not good enough for you? Okay. I saw Nathan pissed and walking off campus earlier. Good luck getting that date, Max. Oh my god. You know what? S suck my one, I right? might feel better taking your drone for a quick flight. Miss Grant finally gave up and let me fly her again. But you're going to the drive-in with Warren, so you don't have time to fly my oh drone. Oh my lord. Really? I can't fly your drone because I'm going to see ape movies with Warren? You are perceptive, Max. Now, excuse me. My drone needs me. Good. Nathan is not around. I should go back to Chloe.
Hey, Brooke. I'm here. I need to find... Ask one. Come on. Warren. Really? I thought I can I... do something here. To Warren. Say some. That makes sense. We'd get the... No All right. I have to go. Talk later, Brooke. Okay, then. Jeez, I thought I could say something to I her. had to clear away another batch of dead birds today. Sad. Makes me mad. How are you doing, Max? Been a tough week. I know. Yes, it has, Samuel. How are you? Sad and confused like everybody else in Arcadia Bay. You look like you have a lot of questions, too. I definitely have questions about what's happening to the animals in Arcadia Bay. Oh, many do. These poor creatures have no choice in what happens to them. How can anybody explain all those poor beached whales? My dad was a fisherman, and he'd take me out to hear the whales sing. Now they... they just cry. Do you think this is some kind of eco-disaster, or...? I think it's more than that. Somebody is causing all this to happen. You think so, Samuel? You and Arcadia Bay are connected by time and tide. So, next time I have a question, I'm coming to you. Ryan and Obo. <laughs> hella hello. <laughs> um. What do you think about all those dying birds? Samuel had to bury dozens near the Tabanga. Tabanga? Is that cool with the Tabanga? We'll find out if the souls of the bird move on. Not that we can prove it. It's so ominous. Unless it's fate, then it doesn't matter. Well, I'm glad to see your squirrels are still healthy and happy on the campus. Me too. If something happened to them... Oh. Not as long as you're here to take care of them, Samuel. The only thing that calms them is food. <laughs> Lots of food. Which reminds me th that I have to feed them now. Max, I agree. He's actually a bit creepy. He's not right, like that, that much of a creep, but at the same time there's something... Something... That gives me, like, you know, climate changes and real my ass. <laughs> I think everything. Hi, Miss Grant. <laughs> what the Max, heck? you always show up when I'm talking about you. No, you just talked about I'm your still ass. I'm talking about you and the other students making Blackwell surveillance free. Jeez. You talked about your ass, not about me. Jeez. I was hoping you could explain some of these crazy things happening in Arcadia Bay. If I could, I'd be collecting my Nobel Prize in science today. I haven't been able to wrap my mind around that eclipse, much less the snow in Wales. Hmm. Huh. There must be a scientific explanation, right? When my friends at NASA tell me they can't explain a solar eclipse without a single theory as to how or why, maybe it's time to get worried. Like they are. I am worried about reality. I feel like it's changing right in front of us. You and Samuel both. We were talking about that before you came over. Our planet is changing, but it's not mystic. It's erosion. You think that's why all these animals are dying here? Well, our shoreline has been receding, not to mention the daily contamination of the ocean. That's all you need to kill off sea and wildlife here. Unless you know something I don't. Mm, time travel. Now let's say it. What about wormholes and chaos theory? I like time travel stuff. The only wormholes in Arcadia Bay are underground. And chaos theory is just that. But if this is about time travel, sign me up. Would you really change time? Not after reading that Bradbury story, A Sound of Thunder. I won't give it away, but it involves dinosaurs and butterflies. Time is like a thread, Max. One tug and it all can unravel. Yep. 
I was looking for Nathan Prescott, and I thought he might be in your class. Mr. Prescott has no class at all after his suspension. I didn't think you were friends. Oh, hey, love. <laughs> Hell no. Sorry, Miss Grant. You're an adult. You can swear, damn it. <laughs> and I'm glad you did. <laughs> so you haven't seen Nathan at all? Let's just say I try not to, Max. But I did catch him storming off campus. After what happened this week, I hope you don't see him either. You're not the best student here, but you, you might be the wisest. Damn. I don't think surveillance would have helped Kate Marsh. Who needs surveillance when we have Maxine Caulfield? You did a wonderful thing, and now we have to make sure Kate gets the help she needs. Do you need to talk to a counselor? Um, yeah. Blackwell Academy needs the help. There's something terrible going on here. You see it, right? This week hasn't been Blackwell's finest hour. But me and some faculty members won't rest until all the students here feel safe, not bullied. Kate was drugged at the Vortex Club party and bullied by them until she ended up on the roof. How do you stop that? Shut down that damn Vortex Club for a start. Yeah. I don't mean to get riled up, but that party should have been postponed. It's extremely tasteless given what happened with Kate. Do the Prescotts have anything to do with the Vortex Club? I mean, they don't get all their money from car washes. No, they don't. But membership has its privileges. Especially when your father is Blackwell's biggest sponsor. This elitist nonsense has no place here. You're right. I, I just wish this could be the school that I dreamed about before I came here. I hear you, Max. I love seeing you and Warren and all my students at your best here. But you're all too young to be so cynical. But you truly give me hope. I'm sorry, Miss Grant. I, I have to get going. I I'll see you later. It's always good talking to you, Max. It's changing here. As a scientist, I'm fascinated. As Michelle Grant... Hey, Daniel. You look bummed out. Are you all right? Hola, Max. I just figured out that my photos basically suck. Ooh. I'm a wannabe artist. Yeah, I love your drawings. You're not here to be a photographer. That's my gig. Look at that sketch you did of me. Incredible. And that's your art. Your gift. <sighs> I do feel better now. You are good, Max. Oh my god. I can talk to them all, isn't it? <laughs> By the way, have you seen Nathan Prescott? Oh, I heard a rumor he's actually suspended. Yeah, but he's still gotta be on campus. That explains why he looked so pissed off when I saw him leaving campus a few moments ago. Have you talked to anybody about what happened with Kate? I don't talk to anyone, Max. But I did actually have a nice talk with Brooke. She couldn't stop talking about how brave you were on that roof. I don't think doing the right thing is brave, but I appreciate what she means. The most important thing is that Kate gets better. And gets justice. I hear that, Max. She's the sweetest, most genuine person I've ever met. I don't mind getting picked on by Blackwell bro holes, but don't fuck with Kate. I like this revolutionary Daniel DaCosta. Only if I can start the revolution from my sketchbook, Max. Are you going to the end of the world party tonight? It will be if I go, man. People here push me into lockers, not dance floors. <laughs> um, um, go to the party, don't go. I don't know. I mean, why would he go if they bully him around? Uh, shit. I don't know. They're gonna push him to somewhere. They're gonna kill him. They're gonna kill him, that's for sure. They're gonna kill him. They're gonna kill him. They're gonna break your glasses. They're gonna push you in a locker. 
and then gonna kill you. Don't go. <laughs> Screw the Vortex Club. They don't deserve you, Daniel. They don't deserve anything. I mean, what do they actually do for Blackwell, huh? You're right, Max. Screw them. Let's talk later. Okay, Daniel? I saved one life. Another, I mean, another one. Yay! Okay, you know what? I'm done. It's too much talking. Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ugh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. It's so lame, they don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. <laughs> Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Uh... Jesus Christ, stop lagging. Now it's Who completely needs a dorm stuck. map anyway? At least I can see that Nathan isn't in room 106 or 108. Uh. Okay, she still needed Nathan's room number. Oh, wow, she, she just got it in time. Oh my god. Kate brings it. So, room 111 is the magic number. Magic. The Prescott's rule this town. Yeah, right, sure. the hell is this now I need to find Nathan's phone or anything with clues Max now that David is not here I need Chloe to step up and stop acting out so much but that won't happen if you and her are getting mixed up in illegal crap like breaking into Blackwell I I know it happened so don't bother to defend or explain I hope you will get her back on the right track, but it looks like she's getting stuck again. You could be a such good influence on her, unless you both want to play by, but she can't keep blaming David now. I'm sorry, Joyce. Even I get into shenanigans, but I am trying to be good influence on Chloe. I know, Max, I forget. You're still teenager adults. You blame me, Max now That's for everything. so cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. Bastard. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the Prescott's rule. I really hope they were all consenting models. It's a BDSM. It's, um, a group. It's Hattori. That is so Chloe. Hey, asshole, we need to talk or I'm going to tell everybody what you did and you're going to pay, mother. Oh my god. Chloe. Oh, Chloe. Wow. Holy shit. Those drugs are real. That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. Oh, it happened here. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. If only all your energy went into fr It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. I don't think this prescription has helped, Nathan. 
Yeah, especially with champagne. <laughs> Nathan is way into this party. Bad sign. Hey God, just let me know what you're wearing to the Vortex this week so I can wear something just as style and inexpensive. Oh, bastard. Now I remember why I hate you. And why Kate will get justice. Party hard, Kate's gone wild. Oh man, that's disgusting. Oh, man. Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. Nate, I know this has been a stressful week, and your mother and I are here to talk if need be. Just making a point anytime, your mother, mother wants Dr. Bill to come out after his book tour. But now let's stick to your prescriptions. Don't worry about Blackwell, this shithole town is going to get a neat. In along with the first but Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. And far away. To the band from Brazil, okay. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Well, I guess this is not... F it, it's he, he combining wow. those pills, isn't he? Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. <laughs> I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Why, well, suit is not bad. I wore that. I have a picture Remember, of that as well. Remember, you're on enemy turf now, Max. Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... Dad, probably. I don't know. Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. These films all have a dark pattern. Oh man, that dickhead stole one of my selfies. <laughs> I wonder why. Nathan Ugh. Prescott, all American teen. Why does he need that if he has you on the wall? <laughs> Disgusting. I don't think one book can guide the Prescotts. What am I searching here for? I mean, I can't see shit. Yes, I would be cool with having this high-tech projector. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Move it. Somebody... Let's find somebody. out what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Now I have Nathan's phone, so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. Get out of here. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So, what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Maybe you leave the dorm first? Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. Maybe leave? Oh, there you go. In right in time, innit? What are you doing in my dorm? It's not your dorm, it's just for boys. You're such a nosy bitch, Max! Stop right there, Nathan! Make me ho! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> uh, Max, what the hell? I got this. You got it, got it. Get the fuck out of my face. <clears throat> Ooh. Uh, <gasps> Kill him. It's you three are of us. So fucking dead. <sighs> what the fuck? Kill him. Get off me, bro. <sighs> he wanted to shoot him. S stay out of it. Stop pouring. Kill him! He wanted to shoot the bitch, damn it. Seriously, why should I stop him? I mean... <laughs> stop it. Corin, stop it! Come on! 
Oh, oh my head. Why are y'all looking at me like that, huh? You and you, you're all dead. Let's go, now. Plus, my dad is on his way. You're all fucked. He owns you. Oh, that's it. Bitch, I saved you. Even if Nathan definitely deserved a beating, we should try to be better than that. No. He said his word. He should have been nicer that I stopped uh, that boy. What's his face? Warren. He's not very nice. <laughs> you like to hurt people, huh? Like Max? Like Kate? Like me? Kill huh? him! Feel this motherfucker! Oh no, don't kill him. For fuck's sake, stop it. Oh shit. Ooh. Jesus Christ. Get up on me! Oh Jesus. Please! Stop it. <laughs> Please stop! Pussy them. I mean what He's down! Hey, come on! Shoot him! Stop! <laughs> Sorry. Yes, we have to go. Who's the bitch now? Chloe. Damn. Wait on. Uh. Uh. Sorry. Warren went full alpha on Nathan, and it was good, but scary. Shit, man. This really hurts. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he, he's dumb to show his gun when he gains nothing from you. <laughs> yeah, right? That's what I'm saying. I mean, I don't know. I don't feel good about it. I think my face is broken. Nah, you know, he deserve it. He deserve it. I want it to be good, but he said that we all gonna pay. We're gonna pay anyway, but at least he, he hurt. Damn, that He's was hurt. intense. Warren, you're a hero. Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For beating the shit out of Nathan Prescott? Dude, you rule. I don't know. I kind of went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Yeah, Just in macho case you man. Need to get my Hulk on again. <laughs> or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better... Um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes. <laughs> you are. Ah, uh, he's, he's, he's cute. <laughs> Hey. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. Yes. I know. <laughs> he really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. Well, we stole monies, so we can pay. But damn, Warren is such a T-Rex. <laughs> damn, macho. Oh, man. <laughs> Why nobody taking away those elves, I wanted to say? Whales. I guess it's it's hard, but hey. 
Still, though. God. I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. That's well, me every time. I gonna help us find Rachel. I wanna kill a mosquito. Or what? <clears throat> You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. Yeah. I am so going to hit you. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just pay Frank his money, and then we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Those cliffs. <laughs> the hell? Ghosts. There might not be any Pan Estates by Saturday. How can all of this not be connected to a major storm? It is. Why are they all so stupid? That's disgusting. It blows my mind that Freaky. I was just here with Chloe in an alternate reality. Garbage day? I'm sorry. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. <laughs> you should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? Lebowski. <laughs> Where's my damn money? <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, I gave money. What's the problem? I stole it. For that. Oh, I thank you. That wasn't so hard now, was it? And let's not do any more business again. Now, if you excuse me. Frank? Could we ask you a couple quick questions? You have some serious lady balls. No. Jesus, okay. okay. <laughs> but I'm not getting you high. No. Frank, we're not here to get high. No. You don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? <laughs> Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? <clears throat> uh, I'm sorry. Sorry for what? Help or else you don't get it. Uh, I'm sorry? For Listen, what? Frank. I'm sorry to be such a nuisance, but this is important. Yeah, yeah, everything's important these days. <laughs> but I can tell you're not bullshitting me. There's no time for that, Frank. I, I just need a little bit of information. Yeah, yeah, well, it always starts with just a little. And Chloe here knows all about that, don't you? Come on, Frank, this isn't about me now. Yeah, right, okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. No deal. Frank, we didn't come here to fight. This is so much bigger than us. Oh, yeah, you didn't come here to fight. A day after, you pulled a fucking gun on me. Oh, come I... the hell on. 
I am so sorry about that. It might be the dumbest thing I've ever done. And I've done a lot of dumb things this week. Finally, I believe you. But don't ever aim a gun at anybody unless you intend to kill. Although you don't look like you could kill a bug. <laughs> I, I try not to. And I never would have pulled the trigger. I think I did, actually. I just... <laughs> Dude, she was scared, all right? You pulled your blade on me. We were all freaked out. Now we're all cool. Please? Okay. We're cool for now. But my dog isn't. And if you try any shit, he will bite your head off. He's done it before. We're only here to talk. I wouldn't mess with your dog. Shit, I kill you wouldn't have it. time. You like dogs? Yas? Uh. What? Wang on, this is a thing, alright? If I say Pompido is cute, he will be like, how the hell do you know my dog's name? If I say I love dogs... I love dogs, what the hell? I love dogs. <laughs> Period. I wish I had one trained as well as yours. Yeah, he had a bad trainer before. Real bad. But he's dead now. And I trained Pompadou how to be my friend. That's very cool, Frank. Your dog is lucky you came along. Maybe we can focus on rescuing Rachel now? Rachel? Is that why you're really here? Yes, we're so close to finding her now, Frank. We need all the help we can get now. Especially from you. You and Chloe do not know Rachel like I did, and I couldn't even help her. You're in way over your heads. Why don't you just go play in your clubhouse? Which photo? Which red letter? Which bracelet? What the hell is going on? I don't know. Flipping bracelet? Whatever. You have Rachel's bracelet. You obviously know more than you're telling. So tell us. Never come into my home and tell me what to do. Understand? Man, there is something about you that is so wrong. I don't trust you at all. Now get out of my face. We don't have much time, Frank. Rachel needs you. It's too late. She's gone. You don't even know her. Like you did? I loved her, asshole. And she loved me. Oh. I know that. Chloe, you don't know shit. You were part of her problem. Always trying to take her away from me. Always! Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch! Get it! Step the fuck back now! What the fuck is going on? Why is he gone stupidly angry? No, bitch, don't Papa you- dude. What the hell? You fucking killed my dog! Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> what the hell is going on? Can I rewind? I don't want to kill dog. I mean, I don't care about Frank that much, but not the dog. Bitch, rewind! Oh no! Uh, are you kidding Chloe. me? I just shot a man and his dog. Kill yourself now, isn't it? Jesus Christ. Rewind! Kill Frank Bowers. Max, are you you saved my life, Chloe. It, it was self defense for both of us. What the hell? I can't rewind. Max? Frank is really dead. I know, but we can't stop now. We have to find that code. Fast. Before the co cops come. Um, excuse me the fuck? That's it. Let's get out of here. Sorry, Frank. I'm sorry. No. Jesus. Chloe actually no. killed Frank. She'll never forgive herself. Or forget this. But he going angry for no Only reason. I can change it. All this because of a bracelet, isn't it? That's what I just said wrong. 
A bracelet. Hey there. Listen, Chloe. Oh. I can tell you for a fact that this will not go well. <sighs> Max, I should have known you'd be kind and rewind. So <laughs> tell me exactly what I need to do here. Watch your mouth. <coughs> I have no idea. Uh. Get rid of gun. You won't like this, but you need to get rid of that gun. No, Max, I don't like that at all. But I trust you. And girl, if I need that gun, you better rewind fast. Okay. Eh. She could have just leave it in in a van, in her not in a van in her card and uh, keep keep money give money. What? No fight, no weapons, no what what what? Frank, um, after our last meeting, I don't want any weapons involved. Could you put your knife or whatever? In the RV until we're done talking. After you pulled a fucking gun on me, you want to negotiate my safety? I didn't trust you before, and now I do less. By the way, never tell me what to do in my oh, yeah, home. Right. Maybe I don't have a fancy Arcadia Bay house, but this is my turf. Got it? You're goddamn lucky you paid me back. So what do you want? Just the names of... Oh, is that all... <laughs> Look at him smiling as well. Oh man, this is funny. You don't get it. I'm so I'm sorry. Listen. So everything was fine yeah. till the bracelet. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Right. Right. Oh yeah, you. I. Finally. I. <laughs> Dude, she was. We're only here. Shit. We we're only here. Shit. I love. Yeah, he had a. That's very. Maybe we can focus. Oh. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yeah. There you go. Um. Listen, I read Rachel's letter. I know how no! much she cares about Fuck. you. Fuck. You read that letter? Huh? <laughs> the one in my RV? Are you fucking insane? No. You read my I... private letter? Man, there is something about you. Oh my lord. We don't have much time. Bitch, I killed him again, didn't I? For the Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch! Get it! How do you like my blade, kid? Huh? Whoa! Whoa! Chloe! Get off of me! Motherfucker! <laughs> no! Ah! Oh, I... Oh my god, what am I supposed to do? Just ask him to, that, that he, she, they, whatever. <clears throat> this is some next level shit. Oh, come on, man. Oh my lord. Listen, Chloe. <sighs> Watch your mouth. Um. You won't like. No. Holy cow, this is like so complicated. Thanks for hearing me out, Frank. Look, we only want to talk, and it's not even about you. We're not here to start a fight. No, that shit would be over pretty fast. Don't fuck with me, and I won't return the favor. So what do you want? Just the names of some of... Oh! Oh my god, why can't I skip it all? Um, I'm sorry. Listen... <clears throat> yeah. There's... N yeah. Come on. Right, okay. Fr oh, yeah. I... Finally. I... We're only. Shh. I. L yeah. That's. Maybe. Oh. Yes. You and Chloe. If I'll show photo. Nah. Uh. 
What are you hiding, Frank? You should want to help us, not scare us away. Don't you accuse me of anything. You don't know me or who I am, or what I can do. You understand? Huh? Man, there is something about oh you. Oh my flipping god. We don't it's, have What am I doing it's wrong? Too late. Oh. I... That the last option is just about a photo. I thought like Listen. You... Thanks. No, that... Oh, damn. Listen, Frank. Yeah, yeah. There's no... Yeah, yeah, well... <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I... 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 Tr Only here... Shit, you wouldn't have to... Jesus Christ. I... Yeah, he had a bad... That's very... Maybe we... <laughs> yeah. You and... That's the last thing I think I can do, is a photo. Rachel said she gave you one of her favorite photos. That proves how much she cares. And you care. That's why you have to help. How the hell did you know about that photo? Oh no. That's my favorite picture of her. Please don't. I can look at it anytime and she'll always be there for me. I can't stand not knowing where she is. Not hearing her voice. Or her laugh. Anymore. We can change all that. It's up to you. Help us find her, Frank. Please. We really need your client list. <sighs> well, if there's a chance in hell, you two dorks can find Rachel. Yeah, I'll take it. <coughs> My dog isn't barking at you, so I guess that's a good sign. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, Frank. Dinky. Seriously. It's hard to take you characters seriously, but I want to. Good luck. Have fun. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, that was intense. Oh, she picked up it. Okay. That was cool Frank gave up the code to help us. Rachel must have seen something good in him. Yeah, I, I mean, I he kind of weird, but I guess he's all right. Unlike Nathan or David Madsen. Even Principal is an ass licker, so. Chloe, I wouldn't trust are you either. okay? <clears throat> I'm glad things worked out okay with Frank. It's nice to have one less enemy in Arcadia Bay. Amen yeah. to that. <laughs> I better focus on this board and start tying these clues together. Hi, Max. Just wanted to see how the search was going. Thanks, Frank. We're getting closer. I see why Chloe digs you. Stop by later if you both want a party and good luck. Oh, look at this shit. Now he's one to, to do some shit. G uh, gather uh, info of a character by selecting all the correct clues for what Let's look at Frank's eh? drug deals during the week of the party. What? What? Frank's account book. But the client names are encrypted. <clears throat> yeah. 
Frank is for sure the local dealer, but I, I doubt Rachel was carrying drugs for him. Right? Maybe Rachel took a road trip with Frank, but she did come back. Well, that gotta take me years as well. So, what happened to Rachel after this? She dumped Frank, but I don't think he would hurt her. There's no doubt she loved him in some way. What should I- I don't understand. Uh... Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Ah, party's week. But when was the party? I'm a bit confused. Does David know what's going on with Rachel, or is he just paranoid about everybody? to analyze Nathan's messages. What could help me un unlock oh, his phone? There has got to be some good shit in his phone. I just need the code to unlock it. Oh, so busted. It's good to see the Prescotts can't cover up all their tracks. Holy shit. Nathan is seriously unhinged. But those numbers might be useful. Ninety five thirty five. Well, come on. She said I need a pin code. Couldn't hurt to give this pin code a whack. Okay, I'm gonna select that. Right? Gonna select the paper. Right? If there is a dark room, we better find it. It's a good thing Chloe slipped all these files on her flash drive. <clears throat> this is the Vortex Club party where Nathan drugged Kate. Did he do the same thing to Rachel at another party? Okay, well, October 4th. Student file. No one cares. Okay, so I guess this might be a thing as well. And when the party was, right? <sighs> Fail. Abort. Wrong clues. Oh. I don't know. Okay, Max. What the Let's fuck? Blow this code up and go home. I think I did something right. I can't believe it. Um, Let's start hacking. <coughs> so not 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 Bad code. Oh, oh. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Uh, you don't know. 
It's just three numbers. That's not gonna be... 5431. 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, You locked it, dumbass. God damn it, you stupid little shit. Oh no. Yeah, there you go. I know that I should. Oh my god, am I so dumb? Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, make sure to change it. Maybe he. Okay, okay, Max. Let me take a picture of this. There you go. Yeah, I know. I know what it is. I had some sim, 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 sim card problems. Um. The God damn it. Ah! Oh yeah. Let's find out what Nathan Prescott has been trying to hide. Whatever. I mean, y'all. Uh, what's up? Need the G. Okay, cool. Bitch should. Bitch, bitch sold me water, asshole. Calm down. Bring it to me. Bring it. Bringing it. Yes. Uh, this is all about Nathan trying to score for the Vortex Club party. Nathan was jonesing hard the night of the party. He didn't have enough drugs. Drug dealer drama. God, Nathan. You're out of control. So it was you. Now I can officially call you a psycho stalker. No, Nathan, it's time for you to watch out. Asshole. Is this from Nathan's father? That's brutal. Did we get anything? Any clues, really? Okay. Coordinates, I'm, I'm sure. What is this? Hmm. Maybe he was trying to help Kate in his own messed up way. Look at all these license plates. I hope he was tailing Nathan. No. It's cars, different cars. Okay. You need to get rid of these damn cameras, David. David really has been on Rachel's ass for a while. She should have been upset. At least David was finally going after the right suspect. Of course, I'm a suspect. <laughs> Proving David sucks as a detective. Sorry. Okay, this is just sad, Max. Oh, I don't know. Looks like David was tracking somebody's car. Maybe even Nathan's. Good clue. And that's all she wrote. <sighs> Please let me find some clues about Nathan in here. Great. Now, how do I find out which car is Nathan's to match the coordinates? There's Nathan dealing to the kids right out in the open. I'm glad Warren got his revenge. Of course Nathan drives an SUV. No, oh, there you go. Overcompensating, as it's, usual. It's a thingy. It's this thing. Hmm. Huh. Who does this car belong to? To him. It's X F T Dr Nundr. Okay. So okay, okay, okay. 
got it. Let me just take another picture then. Jesus Christ, my phone will be full of the <laughs> life is strange pictures. God damn it. Okay. Okay. What is this? <sighs> Who else was David tracking here? Is it that one? Yeah, it is. Uh, it was 8th, right? Or what? Okay. I mean... Ah, that's the thing. That's the thing. And that's the thing. Oh, yes. Now we're finally getting somewhere. Chloe, let's plug in these numbers and see if they lead to an actual address. Aye, aye, Captain. Here we come, Rachel. <clears throat> the other clues? From Frank? Yes. Uh... Kiroki... Uh. Rot must stand for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Rotten. Hmm. Rachel Amber, okay, yeah, this is just not... Oh, it's only two. Oh, okay. Uh, why am I even thinking about it? Yes, the game <coughs> is on. Now, talk to us, account book. Tell us everything. Let's see if I can find any deal Frank made with Nathan or the Vortex Club. Frank sure is keeping his customers satisfied. He could open a store. But the party was at 8. What was it? It was 8 a.m. It was 11. Oh my god, I don't know. It's right there. Shit, hang on. Everybody in Arcadia Bay must be high. <laughs> that explains a lot. If Frank applied this kind of detail to his life, who am I to talk? I'm getting a contact high just reading this. What am, what am I searching for? Huh. Two deals with Nathan on the same day? Oh. Party supplies, no doubt. Okay. I wonder what dog name Frank would have given me. Bob. <laughs> or something, I don't know. Oh. Okay, this is just sad, Max. If Nathan did drug Kate, he must have gotten the. Oh yes. I'm just was sure about these the are two, all the so. times and places for Frank and Nathan's deals. Uh, that's it, Max. Get ready for fucking D. Ah, <laughs> uh, get ready to D. Uh, you fuck up my dorm door, I kill your, I kill your scholarship. Yes. Yes. Take a breath, Max. Go through all this data and you can find out where Nathan took Kate after the party. Uh, uh. Oh, hell no. Uh... <sighs> I'm true detective now. Meet Meet Beach. I'm 
back. <laughs> Welcome back, Max. Pigs on the beach. Okay, they're talking about police on the beach. Got it. So, this infamous party oh my was God. the fourth. I'm, I'm dumb. Yeah, fourth. All seventh. If Joyce knew what Nathan did to Chloe, she would fry his ass. Was Frank meeting Nathan at the junkyard? That beach is like Frank's main office. Oh, that has to be the Prescott estate. <sighs> Poor rich Nathan. Not much out there. Well, it's not much out there. I know Nathan wasn't looking for Bigfoot in the forest. No doubt that Nathan stays in his dorm room. So he could be hiding clues there too. Somebody is stocking up on gas. Why? Okay, this is just sad, Max. Oh. What was Chloe, it? this is definitely the place. Let me dig up some more clothes here. Jesus Christ, I'm a goddamn detective. Nope. Nothing, Max. There's nothing here. Just some shitty old barn. Well, then. Let's keep searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. I'm on this. Hold on. Somebody named... Harry Aaron Prescott. I'm shocked. <laughs> Indeed. Should we call the police? Fuck that. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed up. As you've noticed, this whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody, except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. I was afraid you'd say that. We could call Warren since he kicked Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us, nobody else. And I'm not scared at all. You have the power. I feel like we're this close to finding Rachel. We have to find her, Max. We will. But remember, my power isn't infinite. We still have to be careful. Do you hear, Chloe? Yes, sir. Damn, so much beer bottles. Holy cow. Alcohol and only one bottle of water. <laughs> Holy shit, this is scary. I know, but we're here. Let's go find the best way in. It's not gonna take take that much of a Whoa, check this out. Fresh tire tracks. Strength. Dude, somebody was just here. Then we need to get in that barn. <laughs> it's 
Squirrel. Hi, little shit. I'm going to get you. Look at it. Look at it. Look what it's doing. Oh, my God. Look at it. Look at that little shit. Hi. Look at it. Who been typing? Holy shit. Too many people. Wait. What's the water in? Wasn't important, I guess. It's a bird. Stop. Let me. Hey, <laughs> I think I see something in there. Where? This has got to be it. What? Well, that was easy. door I come on bitch I wouldn't shout all right if I was you oh yes Maximus rules oh Jesus god this is way too Blair Witch I have goosebumps all over come on Supermax oh it's not that bad dude why are you having your goosebumps hey, I remember check out this old chest when we were kids uh, it was a... A little louder, Chloe. Yeah, well, you Jeez, shouted a couple of seconds ago. Ancient. Jackpot. Old shit. No, 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 look closer. Harry, Aaron, Prescott, and family donate new library to Arcadia Bay. Prescott Industries celebrate grand opening. The Prescotts bring bomb shelter boom to town. Nice scrapbook. You search for more clues and I'll scope out the area. When we were kids, it was a thing. <laughs> yes, old Prescott clippings. But that can't be the only thing here. Uh, give giving birthplace, whatever. And it was abandoned, and then they destroyed it. But under this d destroyed construction, Let's go about the perimeter, Max. There has to shut be up! I'm telling a story. Uh, there was a basement. For newborn babies, well, yeah, you know, it's all been collapsed and shit, so we decided to go down there. Yo, that's what's scary, right? That's like a hospital. But it's like, I mean, anyway, that was creepy. This tractor has paid its dues. Unlike this barn, I mean, this is just nothing. It's just like, meh. Could be better, could be worse. Wow, sir. Talk about home on the range. There's no way this rusty ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. Huh. These hooks are used to lift haystacks. I saw them in a Friday the 13th movie. Same. Ah, the good old days. No. Yes. <laughs> so many haystacks, so few needles. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. It's not selfies. Selfies is when you take your whole Chloe would make a great detective too. Well, <sighs> nothing here. <sighs> nothing here.
just rotting wood. If a zombie shows up, I have my weapon. No, Supermax. You can't open this with your bare hands. Well... Okay, Chloe. Um, I, I found some kind of hatch, but it's locked. I got this. I hope. Let me know the second you need any help. Where does he go? Up there? No more secrets, Sean Prescott. Hey, Chloe. It will. Chloe, can you give me a hand? Sidekick at your service. Hop, hop, and away, Supermax. I dig having minions. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that all is falling uh -huh, on her. Jeez Louise. What the fuck is this? <gasps> it's an owl. Oi. Sorry. Oh, you better sleep. No. Okay. Uh, where am I? Help me. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so I needed to do that anyway. I just wanted Al to sleep there, man. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I'm a bit retarded. But yet again, genius. Max Giver strikes again. I wish Warren could have seen that physics trick. Oh my lord. It wasn't that much of a trick. <laughs> Damn, this is heavy. What is this? It's a jackpot. It's a basement. Who could have thought? Do I even really, need guys? to say how weird this is? Why is it weird? It's just, just it. Who built this kind of place? It's a just Prescott, a of thing. course. Why are they acting like it's so weird? In America, lots of buildings like that has like a downstairs thingy. In case of some nuclear bomb fall or some shit. This bunker is so surreal. Oh, that's a banker now, huh? Bunker. <gasps> shit, there was something. Five seven something. How to? Can I? How the? Can I maybe? Was it here? Even Harry Aaron Prescott no. was into selfies. Shit! Wait. That was like a thing in Nathan's thing. Do I have it in my documents or something? Now that's a serious door. Where's Gandalf? 
Where's Gandalf? Yeah. No. When I need him. First a padlock, then a digicode. Someone really doesn't want visitors. This is too heavy to break, so I'll need a code. No, I don't know. One, I, I don't know. It was like five, seven, maybe, and one. Oh, no, it didn't work. Oh, wang on. Two, five, four. <sighs> Wrong code. Two, four, five. Oh, think, think. You locked it, dumbass. Don't worry about it. It's not much of a situation anyway. Wang on. Some numbers look faded, so yeah, I, I just so. have to get lucky. Five, two, four. Oops, bad Five, code. Four, two. There you go. Oh, oh my yes. god, I'm a genius. I thought that only worked in the movies. Holy cow, I feel day. <laughs> I feel good. Open sesame. So proud of myself. Holy shit. I mean, that wasn't that much of a... But hey, still. Stocked and ready for the apocalypse. Yes. This must have cost a fortune. Come on. Foods. More survivalist supplies. Water supplies. It's like in David's garage bunker. Maybe that's the David's thing then. Look at these cans. David must shop at the same store. Uh oh. So it is David. Whoa. This says it all about Nathan. He needs help. He needs help. As Nathan's primary f f psychiatrist for over five years, I feel that I should stop seeing your son as you have disregarded my rather dire and I made it made suggestions of his and others well-being you know well extends challenges I feel that you're freezing oh damn damn that tape Tuck tape in a bunker is always a bad sign. Everything is sketchy as fuck, but nothing about Rachel here. Well, he doing pictures here, seems like. I guess Nathan needs the most expensive printer in the world. Are they here together with Nathan with David? Jesus, I already hate this place. <sighs> that son of a bitch. Talk about tortured. Oh. Let's see what's in here. Oh my god. No. Holy shit. <laughs> it's Kate. It's a Kate. Oh yeah, school suspension is a deal breaker in the Prescott family. Principal Wells has informed me that you have been suspended due to some suspect or the club activity on your part. Never mind that, I just uh, want you to know what kind of shame you once again, once again brought on this family. Well, his father seems like doesn't like all that shit, isn't he? <clears throat> Oh, that's what we saw in the in the the first episode at the end. Come on, let's see what this shit is all about. We are. Okay, a binder marked Victoria, but it's empty. Look, the next one says Kate. 
Oh no, Kate. No. God, I should have killed that bastard back there. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. <sighs> Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. This can't be real. These are all, these are all post shots, right? Right? Yeah. Chloe, look at her face. She's out of it. Maybe, maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think so. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Then, then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead. No way. She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it. Please, let's go. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. This picture is framed different. Rachel is awake and fucking furious. She reminds me of some actor. Rachel is passed out and she has something in her mouth. What happened? This shot is so staged. I, I, I can't believe it's real. I can't. Well, I can. I thought about it. Ah, the Apocalypse Entertainment System. <laughs> ah, our friend might be dead. Ah, some system. I've never seen so much pricey <laughs> equipment before. Ah. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait on. Let me feel like I'm a model. That doesn't feel good. I will. I guess I'm not gonna be a model then. Somebody likes their whiskey. That's an original signed illustration. <sighs> Fits perfect in here. Okay. Bob, slow down. It's pretty rocky, hey? <laughs> Dangerous indeed. Oh, man. Uh, Look, those who this knows, is it. This is knows. it. It's nothing here. Are you gonna help me, Max? Not with hands. Jeez. Take some stick or some shit. Stop. Look. Well, it's just, a, it's just nothing. It's a piece Please, of no. bag. Oh. Oh. oh, that smell! Rachel! Oh. Oh, Rachel, no, no, please, not her! What the fuck? <coughs> Chloe! Jesus Christ, she's, Rachel, she's dead. Why? I'm sorry, Chloe. I'm so sorry. I loved her so much. How can she be dead? What kind of world does this? Who does this? <laughs> um, well, that's a good sign. <laughs> I guess the. I mean. <clears throat> well, I mean. Will. Oh dear, <laughs> oh dear. I mean, I'm not really having that much of uh, emotions about it because I didn't know her. Was it her? <gasps> Was it her? She. W <gasps> Wing on. <laughs> Samuel said something about spiritual animals. All this time, that was Rachel. That doe. Oh my god. I should go to the police and get the body down. I mean, 
you know. I hope Nathan enjoys his last party. Chloe, we can go right to the cops. We That's what proof. we should do. Fuck the police. Rachel wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. And revenge. No. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, mm. and nobody is gonna get in my way. No. Especially with your help. Right? No. I'm with you to the okay. end, Chloe. <laughs> you know that. All right. But I sh I think we should have gone to police. We found a body. It's the dead body on the floor. Where's the damn ambulance? Oh shit! This is like that eclipse! You're right. Look at the outline. Yeah. I can't tell if they're different. Damn. What is that? that? Can't be too much. Jesus, Chloe, look up at the sky. It's, it's beautiful. A double I don't trouble. give a shit. The world is ending. Cool. You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going oh down. Oh my god, bitch. I don't like Chloe, seriously. It's a double move. It's balls. I mean, what? Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. Oh, you in here. I'm glad you decided to escort me. Oh my You look really good, Warren. Are you alright after today? I really flipped out on Nathan. I just hate bullies. And Max, he's dangerous. Where is he? Where is Didn't he? Didn't see him at the dorm again. <laughs> I was held up in my room. Dude, have you been drinking? You know shit. Well, if you consider half a beer drinking. Half a beer. Let's go, Max. Hey, hey. I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? <laughs> I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so... I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know. I'm painting the booty. Just one picture. Just take it already. Uh... Action. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Oh my god, Sorry. shut the hell up. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra-violence. What a bitch. I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey, we still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. He won't. I know how to be invisible here. Not to me, Warren. <laughs> text soon. <sighs> <laughs> oh man, what a guy. All right. Chloe's such a bitch. He's not gonna he's not gonna go anywhere if it's party here. Hi, can I take your coat or anything? No, I didn't see any tablet with cat pics. Okay, Chloe, where the hell are you? Uh, I ha uh, hi Stella! Hey Max, welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? Uh no thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. Why does Nathan creep you out? He should. I, I just want your reason. Why are you shouting? He's a bully for one thing, and he hit Warren for another. But have you ever looked at his eyes? Glazed and raging. Me no like. <laughs> so why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here for the job. Who hired you? Mr. Jefferson asked me because he knows I don't have a lot of money, even with my job and scholarship. I'm not cool enough for this school. Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Well, thank you, Max. I really appreciate that. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I... 
I just need to find Nathan. And don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck. Oh. <laughs> I guess it's supposed to be music. Oh my god. <laughs> Hang on, just for one second. Oh my god! No? Still no music? Marsha! Marsha! Oh well. Where's the <laughs> That looks so weird. <laughs> this is dumb. Did Jay suck? Oh, I'm shocked to see you tonight. We Matt. need to find Nathan, Nathan and take him down. Moon's outside, but Justin. <laughs> uh, hello, Brooke. Max, I didn't expect to see you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but I really need to find Nathan. Have you? No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. I just hate that scrubs and his club. You're not the only one. Maybe this party will be the end of the Vortex Club. Then I don't have to pretend like I care anymore. Have you seen Warren tonight? Why? You're the one going out with him. Oh my Look, god. Enough. I, I am sorry Warren asked me to the movies. But you don't need to give me an attitude. I'd like to think I'm your friend. I know. I get salty when things don't go my way. I'm <laughs> selfish while you go on a roof to help save your friend. You're not selfish, Brooke. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise and kind of invincible this week. <laughs> I think that snow and eclipse gave you superpowers. Ooh. <gasps> Check to see if you can fly. I don't think having superpowers would make my life easier. With great power comes great bullshit. I don't know. It would be pretty kick-ass to battle supervillains over Arcadia Bay. Well, the night is still young, Brooke. And so are we, Max. So let's plan a drone date next week. I'd pay money to see Warren kicking Nathan's ass. I just wish someone would kill oh, me. Oh. <laughs> that wasn't skip. Where am I? What's happening? Alyssa, incoming! I'm on it. Whoa! <laughs> of course, my object angel has stepped up every single time to protect me from the cruel world. Thank you again, Mystic Max. I'm surprised to see you here. I'm so glad I could warn you about all those sneak attacks. You kinda are a superhero. You always choose to help me. It reminds me of the only poem I can quote by a Robert Frost. I could use one moment of poetry right now. Okay, but this is like poet karaoke, so don't cringe. I shall be telling this with a sigh. Somewhere, ages and ages hence, two roads diverged in a wood, and I, I took the one less traveled by, and that has made all the difference. That was beautiful, Alyssa. It was exactly what I needed to hear. Yeah, thanks right. for not cringing, and thanks for watching my back. Blackwell would be so much cooler if we all did that for everybody else. But you're a great start, Max. I just noticed that picture, damn it. Look at that. Bigfoot on otter action. That's disgusting. Luke, I almost didn't see you. Max, you're the only person I don't mind seeing right now. I was looking for Nathan. I've avoided almost everybody here tonight. Uh, why are you looking for Nathan? I want to make sure he's not gonna do anything tonight. Like what happened to Kate. 
Oh wait, I did see Nathan today, nursing a busted face. I had dreams that somebody finally kicked his ass. Well, Luke, sometimes dreams come true. Warren gave him an epic beatdown. Yes, give it up for Brother Warren. <laughs> now all we have to do is drive all these goddamn Prescott vampires out of town. That'll be hard to do when the Prescotts own the town and the Vortex Club. I call it the Vortex Cult. Look at this crap. Dress code? VIP section? Elitist bullshit. Preach it, Brother Luke. Okay, I have to get going. Um, thanks for seeing me. No, thank you. And for helping Shut up, Kate. everyone. And for keeping it real. <laughs> Peace out. No one seems to know where Nathan is. Is he hiding or something? Wow, there's Courtney drinking alone without Taylor or energy drinks, soda, energy drinks. I know somebody has the booze. Yay, nice party, guys. What a song. What a music. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay? Sorry, but I'm on the list. Okay? <laughs> I know that Max Caulfield is not on any list for the Vortex Club. Nice try. Listen! No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. I but need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. But I'm in. Courtney, who the hell's Courtney? Guys, you're about to drown. It's a sharky in the water. This is the Co this is Courtney, right? Hey, Courtney, I need to get in. Hey, Courtney, how are you? Max, our guest star arrives fashionably late. <laughs> Say bonsoir to the end of the world. Even though you flaked on my party makeover, you still get special access to the Vortex Club VIP lounge. You better let your minion know, since she won't let me pass. Oh, that little asshole just made her last mistake. She thinks she's Victoria. <laughs> bye bye Now, let's go make an official VIP entrance, Max Factor. <laughs> get it? <laughs> Max Factor. Uh, maybe hey, Sarah, new... um, do you know that I personally put Max's name on the list? So you, like, decide to block her from coming in while I'm taking a break? <laughs> you're not in charge here. Wait, I, I just... Uh... Oh my god, you're done! And you're off the list permanently. Welcome to the Vortex Damn. Club. Ha! Suck on that. Be... I mean... Yeah, that's right. You're too old for that anyway. Get out of here, you boom, you bum, you boom, you bum. <laughs> oh wow, yeah, Pizzo, such a shit. <laughs> Nathan oh. is the Vortex Club, so his ass has to be here tonight. Thank you, lad. Hang on. Thank you so much for coming by, Max. You lifted my heart, Kate. I was so happy to see you smile again. Means so much to me and so many, to so many others. I have to do to go, but I also wanted to say have fun at the movies with Warren. He's so sweet. He brought. Buy some school books I needed. Give him a hug from me. I will call me as soon as... Hey, you as Max, look at you go, girl! Taylor, Damn. have you seen Nathan yet? <laughs> Damn. No, that's fine by me. He's been getting, like, too buggy and kind of scary. Is Victoria me? might know. Or is everybody here all fuzzy? <laughs> I am so wasted. But what does so Victoria say amazing. about that? She blows it off, but Vic is close with Nathan. They're more like brother-sister. Or something. She really cares about him. Is this why you want to be in the Vortex Club? No, Max. I'm like far from home at a great school. I want to learn things, make friends, and party. But when Kate was on the roof, I knew I'd gone too far. Kate was dosed at the last Vortex Club party by Nathan. So you should avoid any drink here tonight. Trust me, I won't even drink my own water when Nathan is around now. He's a pharmacy simulator. I, I do have to go now. Look out for yourself, Taylor. And give my best to your mom. Oh, thanks, Max. 
She's doing great after her surgery. I'm glad to know you're looking out for us too. I think my photo is very powerful. I know Victoria, Victoria is next on Nathan's hit list. Victoria, your pictures... Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, me, Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you. And me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. I blame Nathan for dosing Kate, but nobody at that party even cared she was so wasted. It's a fucking party! Everybody is wasted! What do you want from me? Some humanity, Victoria. Well, you got Nathan busted out of Blackwell, so you should be happy. And I'm the only person here who cares what Nathan is going through. This is bigger than a problem, child. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's, it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way and, and he's famous. On point, Max. Thanks for admitting again that I have some talent. Not that I think I always do. I don't either, but that's the choice you make. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fate we're not supposed to be friends? <laughs> no need. Why not? Not enemies. Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Whoever makes that decision. That would be us, Victoria. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's gonna happen. But not for the reasons you think. Oh, you look so serious. <laughs> don't warn her. <laughs> Fuck her. <laughs> Kill her. <laughs> Drow her. Drown. Ah. Victoria, listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know Nathan is your friend, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace dark. What? Nice try, Max. But I don't believe you. And why would he do that? That I don't know yet. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. And I think you're next. Max, that is crazy. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not, but you have to believe me. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint, and I deserved it. Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people at Blackwell. Weird, but cool. You just don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks, and I do. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. He's not here, and I haven't seen him. Just make sure you stay away from him. And stick close to your friends tonight, okay? I let you boss me around this one time. And I have other people I can go to for protection. Thanks for telling me this, Max. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. I've got my own protection. Um, text me if you need anything. I will. Thanks, Victoria. Au revoir. Oh, wow. Holy shit, she's not that bad. Jesus Christ. I have a friend. <laughs> what? Uh, a rich friend. Holy shit. Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria. There you are. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the lockers. Damn. 
Fuck Maybe him. he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it, Max. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> Are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. But I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. Jesus Christ. What? A oh, okay. I thought, like, wait, what is he doing here? But now I know. <laughs> okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, look, I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Now this oh, is the most Lord. important step in being that an artist. Such a, Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. And the winner is... Come on! Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. <laughs> I like how everybody <laughs> Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. She is the real everyday hero of Blackwell, and I can't wait for her to come back. Thank you. You suck, Victoria. <laughs> Victoria won. Big surprise. Oh, I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. She sucked him, probably. Yes, oh, disgusting. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Jesus Christ. Wait on a second, I just remembered. I I just better y you know. Eh, you know. <laughs> oh Christ. Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. Why didn't you get the prize? The pro- the- the- the prize. The- the prize? Chloe prize. Or prize. Because, uh, Max, uh, didn't, uh, put her picture. Didn't give picture to Mr. Jefferson. Stop stomping around, Chloe. Right. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump she us. She decided to not give anything. Not to, 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 to do the competition thing. Yeah, going at night time. So smart. But at the same time, they have a gun. It's not a problem. So Nathan wasn't there because for some reason he found out that we've been here. Well, we break into his... Rachel, I will get your revenge. I swear. In his thingy, his um, uh, barn. Jesus Christ, what the hell? Fucking shit. So creepy out here. Yeah. No, even for me, damn it. <laughs> shit, that's scary. Where Next time we catch Nathan, you better rewind so I can kill him over and over. Oh, <sighs> God's sake, Chloe, you have to be quiet. We could die, okay? Max, please hurry! Jesus Christ!
Oh God, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. So it seems like Nathan's supposed to be somewhere around then, isn't it? It's even stupid oh, bit. No. Say something, Chloe. Chloe, look out! What the fuck? Oh, boom, John! What the fuck? Yo, she's dead. <laughs> Chloe. Whoa. <laughs> Bitch, what a twist. What a fucking plot twist. We can't rewind. Nathan, you gon' fucking pay, bitch. I'm gonna kill you. Jesus Christ. What the fuck? <laughs> what? Wait, who is that? What? What? How does he ki- Wing on. Oh, the beat. Come on. Next episode, what's gonna be there? <laughs> wing on, wing on. You accepted Chloe's request. It killed her. Okay. You let Warren beat up Nathan. Oh, people stopped. Well, you know, no one got hurt. Oh, she wounded him. Jesus. Dory believed your warning. Oh, she could not believe. You saved the blue jay. Okay, you didn't disturb the bird's nest. You got David's files in another way. Kate helped you find Nathan's room. Okay. You didn't motivate Daniel to attend the Vortex Club party. Well, because, you know, who needs to go there? He didn't leave a message... On Warren's slate, you didn't figure out Nathan's pin code. Whatever. You helped Elisa. Next episode. Oh my god, what's gonna be there? Please. You. It is fucking Jefferson. What? Dude. Don't do this. Really, that's it. Well, at least we're gonna be in a bunker because I think that's where we are. That's where he took us. Yo, he killed Chloe. We can't rewind anymore. This is this is next level. Where's the Nathan? No, well, come on. It should be it should be Nathan. It should not be him. How is he getting there as well? With us? Well, in a car probably. Yeah, followed us. But damn. Well, uh, Jesus Christ, that's shocking. That's what a twist, what a plot twist, like double, double time, double trouble. Okay, anyway. <laughs> thank you for watching. Um, Jesus Christ, what a shock. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, see you in another episode. Damn, that's gonna be epic. Bye-bye. <laughs>